What is up, ISOC Sticks Multiverse? This is Draven Lawless representing Seattle, Washington by way of Asbury Park, New Jersey. And uh, you know, Draven Lawless, he's an interesting cat, he's an interesting human being because uh, some might remember him as the longest reigning Pacific middleweight champion in the alleged history of Seattle Semi-Pro alleged wrestling. Some might think of him as an alleged performer in the current incarnation of 3 to one Battle. Wednesdays at Rebar. And yet, Draven Lawless, maybe just because it's his birthday, maybe just because he has powers beyond that of a mortal man, he seems to be able to travel from one end of the wrestling multiverse to the other. He seems to find himself here, in a foreign land, doing foreign things. Well, not so much the foreign things, because it's still just punching people. So uh, I'm gonna wrap up, I'm gonna listen for my theme music. I'm gonna go kick and do some punching, and I think maybe some grappling. And uh, I will see you guys out there. I would like to welcome you all to day one of Mercury's International Beating of all these people we got flying in for the show. Day one. I don't know who this guy is. I've never even heard of him. But he flew all the way from New Jersey to be here. I did find out one thing though about this guy is that today is his birthday. Yay! No. Yay! This guy has been around for 13 years in this wrestling industry. Not once has he had a match on his birthday. So what I'm going to do is give him 13 years worth of birthday beats tonight! Oh.
was I was supposed to wrestle one Alex McConnell today and some fat fuck from New York named Sway Side, Soy Sauce, something like that? It's from Pennsylvania. Right? Pennsylvania? Oh, <laughs> still a faggot. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently he's big news on the internet, he's a real tough shit. Found out he's supposed to wrestle me day two in a death match. Cancelled his fucking plane ticket. What a fucking pussy. I don't know if you guys have been to many shows around here, but it is tradition. If BCW, I suck sticks, day two of super shows, I wrestle in a fucking death match. You know I'm wrestling tomorrow? Cruiser fan. Great. <laughs> Do you want a death match? Do you, do you, oh. actually, do you really what? want a death match? What? 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 No! What? No! What? Do I want a death match? Do you guys want a fucking death match tomorrow? Yeah! yeah. Yes. So who you got for me to wrestle? Is Billy here? Did you hide him in your suitcase or something? He would not sit. <laughs> who you got? Who, who you got? We could have a death, death match. You and me. <laughs> you and me. You sure you want to do this? <coughs> Book it. What? What? No. no. What? what? No. no. What? You made no. reservations for dinner tonight? Yeah, make reservations at the mortuary tomorrow. Oh! <laughs> for him.
Wow. Oh. Oh. Please not get. I thought I would. I did. Well, everybody else did, but me apparently. I got blown up watching you. I understand there's a battle royal tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, the winner gets a shot of me later in the card. I know there's a few guys who I've picked in my head as favorites, so I want to win that match. 
Thanks. There's a couple guys I want to face. Nick Price, you're one of them. So, I was going to say best of luck to everybody in that match tomorrow. And I know that the best competitor is going to come out on top. And uh, I'll be ready for you later in the card. Thank you.